live from the WJLA Broadcast Center, this is ABC 7 News at 5, on your side. Well, implanting humans with microchips sounds like a scheme from a science fiction thriller, but the chips let doctors call up individual medical histories with the wave of a wand. Christiane Klein joins us now with more on this breakthrough technology and what it could mean for all of you. Christiane? Well, Kathleen, that futuristic technology is here, and it's put some doctors and privacy experts at odds. This is the future of medicine. You've got your medical record basically accessible in your arm. They're called Verichips. Dr. Jonathan Musher of Chevy Chase, Maryland, has injected them into the arms of about two dozen patients, including retired Navy officer Daniel Hickey. Hickey is healthy, but got the implant with an eye toward the day he might not be. I can't talk and I'm out. I'm, I'm helpless. This way here, they'll have information to treat me. Dr. Bob Rothstein runs the ER at Bethesda Suburban Hospital, the first local medical center to adopt the Verichip technology. With a quick scan, Rothstein and his team pull up a patient's individualized chip code. They plug the code into an encrypted password protected database and pull up data the patient elects to file. Who they are, where they live, who their loved ones are, who we contact in an emergency. Even complete medical histories and advanced medical directives. That's what worries Mark Rotenberg with the Electronic Privacy Information Center. Could all that detail fall into the hands of cyber snoops? These new implantable chips pose one of the greatest challenges uh, to privacy in our modern age. Uh, it gives the ability for others uh, to track you, and I simply don't think we have adequate safeguards today uh, to begin this on a broad basis. Now, the D.C. area is among the first to roll out the new technology, but Verichip expects to have a nationwide network in place over the coming months. That chip implant costs about $200. Reporting live, Christiane Klein, ABC 7.